What's up, YouTube? I just wanted to do a, one more video. I got another package in the mail today. Say, then package. It's not vape mail. It's for the PlayStation 3. My Pelican dual triggers to replace my broken triggers that I broke. <laughs> so, I think the ones I had before were real triggers. I think they're made from Pelican. I'm not sure. I'm just going to go ahead open these ones up real quick and give you a quick look at them. Now, I highly recommend real triggers or dual triggers or whatever you want to call them, you know. I highly recommend them. And I know once I get these on my PlayStation 3 controller. I'm never ever going to want to take them off. So I'm going to wind up crazy gluing them to the controller itself. Because really, no reason why you're ever going to want to take them off. And I just dropped one. <laughs> so just for a quick look. PlayStation 3 controller. It's been a long time since I put these on. Like I said, I crazy glue mine on. So I never really mess around with how you put these on. Because it's been a long time. So. They're not like the real triggers I had before. These ones are a little bit different. But they work good. And I like it when I go to set my controller down. It sets down flat with a little lip right here. And this one came with these bonus silicone caps. I'm going to try to rip those open real quick. And of course, I dropped one. I'm not sure. If I'm going to use these caps, I'll go ahead and stick them on for the hell of it, so you guys can see them. While I'm messing around with this cap, my PlayStation's over there going crazy. Figures. Wants to be difficult. Well, I put this cap on. I will say that this new PlayStation 3 controller that I bought, it is different than my old PlayStation 3 controller. My old PlayStation 3 controller felt a lot heavier than this one. What if I put it on upside down or something? Just set up. I had a hard time getting the damn thing on. It does not want to go on. It's so difficult. My other PlayStation controller did feel a whole lot heavier than this one. And this one feels lightweight. And mine had a smooth, glossy plastic feel to it. This one is more like a, a different kind of plastic. This controller is lightweight. And the plastic feel to it is different. You can see the real triggers. They do work. And if you see the sticks, I finally got one of these rubber things on. So, I'm not sure what the rubber thing really does. I'm not sure if you really need it. But, I'll give them a try. See, you know, if they help. I don't ever have a problem with my finger sliding off the thumbstick or anything. So, yeah. Let's figure I'll give them a try. Paid seven dollars for these from Amazon.com, and I didn't have to pay for shipping. So seven dollars, free shipping. Not bad. Well, since I got my controller and my PlayStation's on, 
I'm gonna go ahead and play some Call of Duty Black Ops 2. See you later, YouTube. And remember, if anyone wants to play Call of Duty Black Ops 2 with me, my name is Slaytanic Jim, just like on YouTube, Slaytanic Jim, on the PlayStation Network. Time to go punks and newbies. Later.